Item ID AEP-035. Enclosure designation Meridian. Threat classification FIS-03. Adaptive enclosure protocols AEP-035 is to be kept in a locked room at containment wing within Site-074. AEP-035's containment can only be entered with direct supervision from at least one ADF and documented permission from personnel with no lower than a level 2 security clearance. Every three days, a participant should be sent into AEP-035's containment cell after drinking no less than eight fluid ounces of the participant's choice of coffee. One armed member of ADF must accompany each participant at all times until their termination. The participant will be instructed to drink the liquid within AEP-035-1. Once AEP-035-1 has been consumed, they should be escorted back to their cell before more can be consumed. The next participant should be assigned to AEP-035 at the next scheduled time. When one participant has consumed 20 instances of AEP-035-1, they are to be terminated. When all five participants are terminated, new ones should be assigned to AEP-035 immediately. Note, a participant is defined as a member of a group of five Class O personnel who are assigned to systematically consume AEP-035-1 to avoid increased aggression in AEP-035. This group of participants should contain no Class O personnel with a history of addiction. The participants group should also contain no members with direct British heritage. All five participants should be placed on suicide watch and should be watched by one member of ADF at all times until termination. Description AEP-035 is a normal-sized carmine-painted teapot. Six terracotta-colored spider-like appendages made of hardened clay protrude from the base of AEP-035. These appendages seem to peak from the lower half of AEP-035. AEP-035 has a cap that cannot be removed despite all attempts by the association. Additionally, samples of AEP-035's clay reveals no anomalous properties in the material. AEP-035 is variably hot to the touch and has a recorded lowest temperature of 71.1 degrees C immediately after AEP-035-1 was consumed and a highest recorded temperature of 829 degrees C after 20 days of isolation. If conditions are met, AEP-035 will manifest an ornate glass teacup filled with two ounces of a semi-translucent deep magenta-colored liquid, which is similar both in smell and taste to hibiscus tea. This is to hereby be referred to as AEP-035-1. AEP-035-1 will always retain the temperature of 71.1 degrees C, regardless of AEP-035's temperature. Symptoms involving the consumption of AEP-035-1 are currently incurable and include the following. Increased aggression towards all forms of life except microorganisms. Decreased brain functionality, starting with a 10% decrease in brain function after the first instance of AEP-035-1. The presence of a clear British accent, seemingly from a southern Wales dialect. A heavy addiction to AEP-035-1. AEP-035 seems to have no melting point despite all testing by the association. Depending on the number of days it has gone without someone having consumed AEP-035-1, AEP-035 has a recorded lowest speed of 40 km per hour and a highest recorded speed of 241 km per hour. This highest speed was recorded during a period of isolation where no instances of AEP-035-1 were created or consumed. AEP-035 will roam around mindlessly when humans are not interacting with it, and will only change its behavior when it comes within five feet of sentient life or senses, through unknown means, an obstacle in its path. If AEP-035 encounters an obstacle, it will attempt to go around said obstacle. AEP-035's behavior will change after five days if there has been no consumption of AEP-035-1, and AEP-035 will try to jump over all obstacles. Additionally, after 20 days without any consumption of AEP-035-1, 
AEP-035 will ignore any obstacles and will attempt to burn through them while walking into them. When any human comes within 5 feet of AEP-035, AEP-035 will approach them. AEP-035 will proceed to manifest an instance of AEP-035-1. If the human target refuses to consume AEP-035-1, AEP-035 will become incredibly violent toward the target, and attempts to scald the human by pouring a tea-like substance onto them from its nozzle. The violent outbursts of AEP-035 usually end in the termination of the target due to severe burns to the cerebrum. Note, AEP-035 seems to be capable of doing this an infinite number of times through unknown means. Should the target consume AEP-035-1, they will immediately undergo AEP-035-1's symptoms. After AEP-035-1 has been consumed ten times, the person, hereafter referred to as AEP-035-2, will have deteriorated into a mindless aggressive humanoid. AEP-035-2 will carry and brandish AEP-035 and will attempt to terminate all life within line of sight. While AEP-035-2 is active, AEP-035 will show no anomalous properties outside of indestructibility. This behavior remains constant until AEP-035-2 is terminated. AEP-035 will return to its normal state when AEP-035-2 is terminated. Recovery log AEP-035 was found in on AEP-035 was found by ARD Zulu-5 after a police call from reporting a strange man committing a murder with a teapot, later identified as AEP-035. ARD Zulu-5, codename Redcoats Falling, arrived at to see a floor splayed with blood and a tea-like substance, as well as five people staring down at three dead bodies, one identified as AEP-035-2, as well as AEP-035 wandering the room. Agent proceeds to take AEP-035 by its handle and swiftly take it to on-site containment before it can react to him. At the same time, Agent was ordered to bring in the person in charge of for an interview, while the rest of Redcoats Falling controlled the crowd and administered Class B amnestics to people currently in Access Interview 035-1 Interviewed Jackson Assistant Manager at Interviewer Agent Redcoats Falling Officer Forward Jackson was brought to a nearby alleyway to avoid any witnesses overhearing the interview Interviewee was still slightly traumatized after the events of AEP-035's discovery. Begin log. Agent. Sir, I need you to try your best to stay calm and tell me what happened as best as you can remember. Jackson. All right, all right. Jackson breathes deeply in and out for about five minutes. So, this lad walks in, right? He seems to be a couple of sandwiches short of a picnic. His eyes snapped over to the person closest to him, and he started walking over to them. The only weird part of it was the teapot with legs in his hand. Probably some American, I thought. Then this bloody guy, addressing AEP-035-2, starts beating the poor lad to death with the teapot. Killed him before anyone knew what to do. And then another lad runs over and tackles him into a chokehold. And after a small struggle, the weird fellow, addressing AEP-035, AEP-035-2 just slumps to the floor. The chuffed bugger just stomped his head into a pulp in a rage. That bloody bloke probably cost us a bomb. All right, that explains the first two bodies. But what about the third body? That's the weird part. I swear, I must be dreaming or something. The teapot, AEP-035, crawled up to the prideful bloke and just conjured a teacup with tea in it. AEP-035-1 The poor fucker says no, and the teapot just leaps onto his face and pours the tea into his eyes and face. Poor fucker's face melted off. Man, just thinking about it makes me want to chunder. Seeing his face melt and... Oh, God. Jackson. 
proceeds to vomit on the floor, visibly disgusted. Thank you. Come with me, and we'll take you back, and it'll all be all right if you just listen to us. End log. Closing statement. Agent and the rest of ARD Zulu 5 successfully administered everyone who saw the event with Class B amnestics and suppressive amnestics. Jackson was able to return to work, and the day continued as normal. The police report reads that a drunken man killed two men at and was then killed by Jackson in an act of bravery. Addendum 1. It should be noted that the effects of AEP-035-1 are doubled when ingested by anyone with a mother or father of immediate British descent. The reason for this is currently unknown. Addendum 2. The effects of AEP-035-1 are halved when coffee is consumed within two hours of ingesting AEP-035-1, meaning that it would take 20 instances of AEP-035-1 for an instance of AEP-035-2 to be created, as opposed to the standard 10 instances. Value Assessment N.A. 